a little bit deeper now. Um, trail's gotten a little bit overgrown in places. Definitely had to kind of hack and whack my way through. See, there's a lot more debris in here. There's a lot more debris on the ground on the trail. I just bumped into a few day hikers and they kind of warned me about the uh, overgrown state of the trail. But again, it's a fairly pleasant trip through the forest today. And, you know, an overgrown trail is nothing I haven't handled before. So, not too bad. Now we have some more trees. We got some, some nice pretty oaks here. I did have a little bit of trouble going through one section that was a little swampy. And uh, my shoes, which were brand new, hold on, brand new shoes, got basically trail baptized <laughs> when they went through the swamp. And I, I had one pair of socks that was not cardboard yet, and I think that just made them cardboard. But this part is really nice. This part's really pretty. Going through some pretty oaks, getting later in the day. Snake on the trail. I almost stepped on this poor thing. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. There he goes. As we've established, I'm very intimidating of a creature. Got a little under two miles to my campsite. Now, nice clear trail again. A little bit of a change of scenery again. Now I'm in a pine forest. Got all these pine needles on the ground and pine cones. A lot of variety today. I am a little less than a mile from my campground. And I should get there with daylight to spare. But very cool. I like the pine forest. So I'm here. The campground kind of snuck up on me. Joshua Creek Campsite. That should just be down here. I just filled up with water from Joshua Creek, Creek itself. And pretty short day today. It'll be a pretty short day tomorrow as well. But that might be a good thing because tomorrow I'm potentially getting some, some weather here. I'll have to check the, the forecast again because it changes pretty rapidly here in Florida. But here it is. Nice lovely campsite all to myself.